Hello friends and welcome back to The Surge. This is Savage Sasquatch from GamingReportCard.com and we have another interesting episode here. So there's a door we can go through. In our last episode we started exploring this area. We found it branches out kind of a lot. And every time we come to a new area it just seems to go two or three more directions. So... Right now, we've kind of hit a dead end, except for the fact that there's two more directions. So, this says warning high voltage. I'm curious what that's going to entail. This is the power plant. We'll also go open this direction. I don't think anybody from that... Oh, this goes up. Anybody follow us out there? No, they did not. After the recent events and the continuing threat to Creo security, we are asking all employees to remain vigilant. Please, if you see or hear anything suspicious, report it immediately to your supervisor. Protect yourself, your job, your family. Terrorism is everyone's problem. Okay, this is a maglev. It's out of order. So probably have to use the power plant to get this back online. This doesn't strike me as the right direction. The power plant here. Alright, does this guy see us? Let's get that stamina back. Gosh, come on. Sometimes going for that limb, like you end up taking an extra hit or two, which is critical. I'm assuming we still don't have anything. Nope, we don't. There is something on the other end of that door. Trying to get in. It's a little creepy. Oh, he did get a hit in. I was... You never want to bankrupt yourself on stamina if you can help it. Is this up here all for nothing? We had to go down? I realized something else that I know about the game. Um, from somebody who had played this early that said that there are not as many bosses in this game. So I'm less worried about hitting bosses right now than I would be in Dark Souls. Otherwise I would be running back to... Um, How do we... Gosh. We're getting really far out. We've got one heal left, but I don't... I really want to upgrade a lot more, and like we're carrying a bunch of resources. So if we're going to explore, let's at least explore. Whoa. Let's at least explore... Um... He came out. Crap, I'm sucking, guys. Sorry.
Man, there's always constantly another path. I would love for this to connect to something else. with his head. We're already at level 5 proficiency with one-handed weapons. I'm curious how high it goes, because it feels like we are reaching good levels really fast. But it could go to 100 for all I know. Oh man, that's not good. This is actually really bad. I know where I am. We're pretty much at the point now we're going to make the mad dash for our base. Because we fell down unknowingly in the middle of terrible things. Carrying with no health. Alright. Gear assembly. Body gear. What are we missing? We don't have enough of those. So another leg piece I think is warranted. So now we should be able to go here, and we need more. Now this is starting to make sense. That's a big deal, because now we get another slot. We're going to go ahead and dump out lots of, lots of points here. Okay, and so we've got two arms, two legs. Who knew? Right? Look out for your fellow workers. They look out for you. Neat. Alright, we're going to go back in here. Since we know everything spreads out really quickly here, we're going to go and try to head down from here. This guy's going to probably attack us. I don't even know what I targeted. That's not good. Come on, you donkey. Finish him. Excellent. There's another guy over here somewhere. There he is. Well. All right, we're going to check out what's down here. We've got a We've got to, like, circle out some of these dead ends early on, just to figure out where...
Did that get his attention? There's a second guy back there that it's trying not to make too obvious. Let's get our, our health back. Well, we just took it right off. That works too. Press down to toggle your gear lights. I don't think I have gear lights. Unless I have an implant. We have an extra implant slot. We have nine implants now. Wow. Interesting. It's another healing item. I wish it would tell me why I can't use these. Oh, we've got to be at the med bay to do this. I see. Oh, wow. We have items that recover that give us more tech scrap. That's not cool, dude. Okay. So the little dude made a big dude. Alright, good. We got them separated this way. I don't like going through here only by the light of the guy's weapons. We do need to figure out a flashlight. So there's another way down here and another way down here, but we have no light. So until we have a light, this is not a good path for us. Get the little guy to follow us.
I don't know what happened there, but that's not going to be a fun place to recover our body from. No, indeed. Good to see you. The implants. Oh, you can bank tech scrap. is our highest priority and should be yours. So as long as we stay away from this thing... <clears throat> wow. Wow, that's huge. <coughs> Does it not break down beyond this? So what was that thing guarding? What back here was so important, or did it just want us to see if we would take on this challenge? Which I respect that too. But 360 is not a lot of scrap to give me. There was something there. We still got two of our um Let's go back here and see if we can isolate someone. here a while back too.
Okay. Man, we're up to 4,000 already. The levels are flying early on. I'm trying to be really careful. Oh. And that's not how you be really careful here. That helps, though. Extra health. I wanted to get an execution. Oh, well. Oh, gosh. I was doing that as just to find loot, not to find something trying to murder me. Thanks, guys. Well, there's loot, though. We're going up before we go down. That's always my mantra here. And by mantra, I mean like things I've never said. But yeah. There we go, back to full health. Almost fell down again. Jewel break time. Okay. We still don't have enough pieces there. We do have this. Can't upgrade our gear at all. So that means the rest is all getting dumped in here. Like three more levels. And bank. Okay, we got a piece of headgear now. We just need a body gear and be careful out there. So I think now we should finally figure out what to do up here. Now that we've cleared out the loot and fallen down a couple times, what does this say? Resolve is not the answer. Looks like some kind of heavy. guy is like a berserker. And I was so busy trying to just get, find some room to maneuver. Two and a half minutes, folks. This is the part where we ju we're just going to start skipping the little guys. Very low reward versus risk, so...
This, however, was a better reward versus risk. I don't think those things will follow us. Buying ourselves some more time here. Alright. We're going to skip all these little boogers right here. Hopefully they can't get too involved in the fight up here. Buys you like bought us 18 seconds on him. Okay. As long as you keep killing guys, you pretty much pave your way to being okay, but. Okay, we know we got the Berserker up here. And it looks like that's the, all that we have is the way that he's guarding. So. got a new weapon from him and you know when you're ready for him and you're a little less scared you perform a whole lot better Have we been here? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Where the heck am I? This is not a scheduled break. Oh. Well, this is very good then. We now have a way. We now have a way to get further quicker. We've still got plenty of curative items. This isn't my favorite of shortcuts, considering it's got the Berserker on it. And a lot here can't be skipped. But having a nice circular path is very useful. Man, these episodes are going forever. I'll have to edit these down to make sure that they're a little more watchable and uh, less redundant for you guys. But... It's been an interesting journey so far. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Uh, make sure to leave us a comment. Let us know what you think of the game. This is pretty much sci-fi Dark Souls with less bosses. And um, anyway, uh, yeah, leave us a comment. A thumbs up is appreciated. We'll see. It. Let's see how many of those we can get. Every bit of support helps us. And above all, please subscribe to the channel, and we'll make sure we keep plenty of videos coming your way. Until next time, this is Savage Sasquatch from GamingReportCard.com, and I am out of here.